Hello folks, Appfielder here with another Minecraft tutorial and today we are looking at the Tweakaroo mod for Minecraft. Tweakaroo is an absolutely massive kind of quality of life mod and it has so many little tweaks and things that just make Minecraft just that little bit easier to play. I absolutely love it, I use loads of the features but it is a really complex mod and it's difficult sometimes to figure out which each of the tweaks do. So this will be a series of videos covering individual tweaks that makes it really easy for you to find the one you are interested in and we'll cover off how to set them up and how they work hopefully you'll find these videos useful if you do obviously hit the subscribe button and let me know in the comments that you have subscribed I'll say hello let me know which tweaks you want me to cover I've got a list of the ones I use but I'd love to know which ones you're interested in this video though will be covering how to install tweakaroo it's going to be a very quick guide to it I've already done a video on installing fabric which you'll need and installing mods in general if you're struggling with this go and watch that video link will be in the top right hand corner it will also be in the description of the video assuming however you have fabric installed then all you need to do is go to curseforge.com forward slash minecraft forward slash mc hyphen mods forward slash tweakaroo don't worry link will be down in the description and then on the right hand side if you scroll down to recent files assuming you're on the later versions of minecraft you can just go ahead and download the relevant one for you if you are on an older version you can get to it in the files there we go it looks like actually it might only go back to 114 but anyway if we go back to the description it's important to note that this also requires the malalib library mod if you are using fabric and what have you this mod is used quite a few times by different mods so it's actually always useful to get and you will need it for this one anyway what you'll end up with is two jar files and you're going to need to drop them in to your mods folder this is my Minecraft mods folder. As you can see, I've got that one there and the Tweakaroo mod there. Just a little tip for you, and you'll see this in the Fabric video, but if you're struggling to find your Minecraft directory, as long as you didn't change it when you set it up, percent app data, this works for Windows, then backslash dot, and then you can collect your Minecraft. You probably only have one instance. I've got several. I may talk about that in a different video about why I do that. Anyway, you'll have this mods folder if you have Fabric installed, and that's where your mods are. Okay, switching over to our Minecraft window. I'm just going to come out of there. Once it's all installed, launch your game. And then to get into the, the menu for Tweakaroo, X plus C. And there you go. You can see we have lots and lots and lots and lots to cover. Okay. You can change the menu key if you want. Open config GUI X plus C. You could change that. You just click on it and set the buttons that you want to open the menu. But I am going to leave it as the default for this series. The second way you can get to this is I have another mod called Mod Menu installed. Really useful. If you hit the escape key, you can see I've got this extra button saying Mods 10 loaded. And if I hit that, you'll see I've got Tweakaroo at the bottom. So Mods Menu and there you go, mod, mod menu, there you go, that's the one I've got installed. Anyway, if you hit Tweakaroo, top right hand corner, hit configure, will take you to the menu as well. Folks, that's it for video one. As I said, if you find these videos useful, please subscribe, but also please let me know you've subscribed down in the comments so I can say hello and tell me what you want to cover as I said. Folks, I'll be back with video number two and it's my favorite tweak. It's so, so useful. Come and watch the video. Anyway, folks, I'm Abfielder. That's all I've got time for. Goodbye.